So I just came across a cool trick uh, for removing clipping in an audio uh, file. I just did this session with a friend um, and she hit this really loud note. I wasn't expecting it. And so I, I pulled the mic preamp back right after the note hit. Um, so the amount clipped is fairly short. And I want to see if I can recover this because I won't be able to have a retract this for a little bit. And I want to play with it. So I brought my clip into Audition here. And you can see right here, it's, it's majorly clipped. And if we play this back, you'll see what I see. You'll hear it. So you can hear that clipping and then it, you know, I pull, I managed to pull back the uh, microphone preamp. And so one interesting thing is you may not know this, but when you take a uh, piece of audio and you turn it into, or you clip it, you're actually adding um, harmonic distortion. So you're adding higher harmonics. And if I come and I click on this little triangle here, come into the spectral analyst view, you can see all these higher harmonics that are, you can see the clipped part clear as day right here. And so what I want to do is I want to, I can use auditions tools to heal this area. And so to do that first, I'm going to use an amplify plugin and bring this thing down like uh, let's just key it in negative one DB here just to give it some headroom. If you don't do this, it'll actually still, be clipped and if I come back to the waveform you can see now I've got some headroom right here so come back to spectral analyzer I'll just do a simple box selection around this area right click on that and then come down to auto heal selection which you can see has a, a hot key of control U. so if I click that it'll heal that and now if I play through this watch this It's a little bit crispy, but I'd say that's perfectly usable considering what we had to start with. Let's see if maybe I can smooth some of these transitions out. It doesn't really look like it. I'm going to see if I can delete some of this high frequency content. Clean that up. Fly. And that's it. You can see now our waveform is nice and pretty, just like it always should have been. So now I can save this and fly right back into Pro Tools and continue on mixing. Anyhow, thought I'd share that tip. Have a nice day.